opened its doors in 1987. It was hosting the 88 Games for Speed Skating. And I don't think back then anybody had any idea that 24 years later would still be the best training facility in the world, not just for speed skating, but for sport. And it's become a huge part of the Calgary community as well. It's the programs and the coaches and the people that make up this facility. My name is Marcel Lacroix, Associate Director here at the Olympic Oval. Well, the Oval program is basically the stepping stone towards making the national team. Well, the Olympic Oval is the place in Canada, but also internationally, in terms of high performance support and high performance facility in terms of everything they need to be able to perform in a day in, a day out uh, environment. I'm Cameron Keelan, director of the Oval here at the University of Calgary. The Olympic Oval is a 1988 legacy facility that's been a world-class venue since the inception. The Olympic Oval has a lot of opportunities here for people to come and train. Not only is it a, the greatest and best ice in the world, but it's associated with close residents so people can walk and enjoy the training. Calgary's got a great economy where for other international dollars coming in, it, it works well. For the Canadian dollar, we have the university which has sports med, rehabilitation area, and it gives a unique opportunity for not only on ice training, but off ice training for high altitude training for all the countries that want to come and train here. Well, the Olympic Oval was designed in 1987 for the 88 Games, and now we host the best programs in the world for both long and short track speed skating. The short track facility here provides the safest environment as well as the best ice in the world. Uh, the skaters have access to two sessions a day, basically seven days a week, as well as the running track, the bikes, the testing, all the sports science is available for them and their coaches to again give them the environment of excellence to succeed.